You might be in a position where for some reason your voicemail is not working on your Android phone. Now this can happen for a few different reasons and it's not really that hard of a thing to do. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and make sure that your voicemail option is showing up. If your voicemail option is not showing up, just like how it's not showing up for me, the main reason why this may end up happening is because your cell connection or your cell, you know, your SIM card or whatever you have inserted on your Android phone just may not be working properly. So make your way over to your Android phone settings. So tap into settings just like this. And what you're going to want to do here is you want to go into like either the cell connection options or just tap on network and internet, something along those lines. And you want to go ahead and open up your specific SIM cards and you want to go and see if your SIM card is actually installed and properly working on your phone. For a lot of people, it may not even be properly working and that's probably all you're going to have to do for the most part is to go ahead and fix it like that. Now, if you do that, that may or may not work in and of itself. So another thing you may want to try doing is to actually go through and see if for some reason your cell connection is just being weird. For a lot of people, if your cell connection is just off or if it's not working properly, that can be one thing that you may want to just double check. So just make sure that's not the case and that may end up you know, kind of fixing the problem for you too. If that's still not working, another thing you may want to try doing is just seeing if you can actually call your voicemail. So this includes just calling your own number or you may, you may have to contact your carrier and you know, see how you can access your voicemail that way. So tap in your phone number and you might be able to access your voicemail that way and it may just miraculously start showing up. But sometimes your carrier hasn't you know, actually showed your voicemail option yet either. So you can also call your carrier, your cell phone carrier, like T-Mobile, Verizon, whoever else you have. And you may just have to go through and basically just see if for some reason you can get that voicemail option to pop up. For a lot of people, that might be all you have to do as well. So that's another thing you may want to get into. Ultimately, if none of those things are working, you may just want to try updating your Android phone. So hop inside of your settings application like this, scroll into system, scroll over until you see system update, and go and just update your system. And that's another thing that might end up fixing the problem too. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.